Every man has his cool stuff, and they're all different. But when you know Fisks, you'll be a clown. Dude, you should have seen the action kill, like. Uh, my cool stuff with, with Colin Fisk and my boys, Big and Eric Belgium, start in the kitchen. Is there any special significance about the refrigerator that you'd like to share? The refrigerator, the fridge, we call it the fridge. I got a watermelon. Got that from the. We just got a van, thousand bucks. It was cool. nothing. Cool, yeah, that's very interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And cool, then, keep uh, going, yeah. So, what's this for? Jankum? Jackass. I tried to touch his food and he clawed me. Oh wow, a fixed gear. It's on a bike messenger, you know. You don't have to fix them up in the winter. It's on the bike, little wiggles, wiggles. And then I got a fancy lad sticker, a heroin bondage girl sticker. Recently got kicked off the team. That's cool though. Uh, I got an arrow spoke, got it for $100. They're worth $300. They're a little heavier than the other ones. I got a lot of bikes. We got fancy lad art. We do a lot of fancy lad art promotional stuff for our company. Fancy lad. Skate related artwork. Skate related artwork. Get this one again. And this too. This one. Program some of the techno the techno artists are using these days. If you can call them artists, they're using the actual Game Boy. But I have this thing. It's Ableton Live. You know, you wouldn't really know how to use it, but it's cool. Let's be a test. You know, you'd want to hang out with us. Just stuff. knowing that at any moment, really, at any moment that you're hanging here, you just pop in a VHS tape. You don't know what it's gonna be. We're so sporadic here at the Fancy Lad headquarters. We could pop in Home Alone, or we could pop in Wrathchild. We could pop in Mad Max, Beyond Thunderdome, or we could pop in Terminator 2. You just don't know, really, and that's what makes, we could pop in Seinfeld. You know, like Kramer just pops in to to Seinfeld's yeah, Bart, house, we Bart might Simpson just do right that. Here. The DVD. Got a couple, Bart, a couple Simpsons characters lying around the house. Nas City Phantasm. These are Bloodmobile wheels. My cousin Brian Fisk owns a skateboard wheel company called Bloodmobile. Doug Moore is his only rider. Down a big hill. Your bowling ball's name's David. Fisk, can we please go to Orchard today? I just need to buy new shoes. <laughs> Nintendo, anyone? This is Super Mario Bros. 3 strategy guy. First Big Brother I got because I made it because Jeremy Klein likes Street Fighter 2. I've never played the game personally, I just like Jeremy Klein. What are these marmalade trucks? Hollow Kingpin, Hollow Axle, Hollow Hardwares, Hollow Base Plate, lightest trucks in town, marmalade trucks. The board actually has uh, an air bubble layer in between the uh, the seven plies that gives you a shock absorbing when you're all in downstairs. You know about you've all read Goosebumps. These are the only books I read. Goosebumps, Goosebumps, R.L. Stein. He wrote them all. He's a psycho. <gasps> WrestleMania mags. Rails on it. So and then I waxed up real good. I melted wax over it. So pretty much it's just a snowboard. You can see the tail grooves because you put in a lot of weights and you can ride. And then I drilled in screws and then I grinded them off for grip. Because in the snow you need extra grip so you get have spikes. So you just hold the string and you ride down the hill. 
but what we didn't talk about was my very favorite movie, which was Home Alone. I mean, growing up as a kid, well, here it is, the VHS. You guys think I have cool stuff, right? Don't you? Sure we do, Fisky. Sure we do. <laughs>